hello guys welcome back to the channel and in this video i'm going to show you the simplest way to complete this lab so first of all just simply log into your credentials and once you're done with that just simply come back over here click on the checkbox and then just simply click on agree and continue now just simply wait and just simply activate your cloud shield it will take a couple of seconds so just simply wait for that and now just simply click on continue now in the description box of this video i will share one github link just simply click on that link and then you are able to access this document now what you do just simply scroll down and from here just simply copy this first command copy like this come back over here click on this got it now just simply wait now just simply paste the command over here like this way and now for the region what you do you have to come back to the lab instructions and just simply click on the task number one like this way now just simply scroll down and from here you can see this region so just simply copy this region like this way come back over here paste hit enter like this way now again come back to the github repo scroll down then copy the second command copy like this come back over here paste hit enter wait for a second and then just simply click on authorize now you have to just simply wait for this command get executed it is going to take at least five to 10 minutes so make sure that your laptop will not go for a sleep otherwise your clock will be disconnect and because of that you might face an unnecessary error on that particular task now just simply wait for a couple of minutes
and it's finally done. Now I request to please pay attention over here. Now here you can see it's asking for the password. For that what you do, just simply come back to the GitHub repo and just simply scroll down. And from here you can see it's mentioned the password over here. So just simply copy this password carefully. Make sure that you do not copy any extra space. Otherwise you might face an error. So just simply copy this password like this way. And one more thing guys, password is not visible for us. So basically what you do, we have to copy the password, come back over here, paste and hit enter like this way and now just simply wait and then you connect it to the data set over here like this way now again come back over here scroll down a little bit and then copy this command copy like this come back over here paste hit enter like this way and then you will get this kind of output now what you do we have to just simply come out this database over here so for that what you do just simply scroll down and from here just simply copy this forward slash and q just simply copy these two things come back over here paste hit enter like this way and now you come out of the database over here now again just simply scroll down then copy this last command copy like this come back over here paste hit enter now just simply wait for this command get executed and once it's done we are done with the 90% of the lab and it's finally done now just simply click on this link like this way just simply click over here wait for a second and you will get a this kind of page if you are not getting this kind of page that means you have made the mistake over here okay you can't undo your mistake you have to just simply restart the lab if you are not getting this kind of page now what you do you have to just simply click over here a couple of times then click on this vote for space couple of time like this way okay you can type any time like this way like this okay now if we just come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for each and every task you will get a score without any issue and if the score is not updating for any particular task no need to worry about that just simply wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a full score on this lab without any issue as you can see it's done and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys